In this lesson, I'm going to show you the most basic rock drum beat. I'll show you how the beat uh, is played and how it sounds, and then we'll break it down into its individual pieces, and then put it back together so you can go try it on your own. Uh, first, let me play it for you so you can hear exactly how it sounds. Okay, now what I'm playing is made up of three parts. I have my right hand, which is playing the hi-hat, my left hand, which is playing the snare, and my right foot, which is playing the bass drum. Now if we start with the right hand, which is on the hi-hat, we're playing one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and, just like this. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Next, we have the right foot on the bass drum, which is playing the one and the three, and your left hand on the snare drum, which is playing the two and the four. So if we do those together, you have one. Okay, so now let's take this one and two and three and four and, those are called eighth notes on the hi-hat, and put it together one at a time with each other piece. So first let's do the hi-hat with the right hand and one and three with your right foot. It goes like this. Next, let's do the right hand and the left hand. So you have your right hand still playing one and two and three and four and, and your left hand playing two and four, like this. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Okay? So now we need to try and put them together. First things first, if you can't play it slow, you can't play it fast. So make sure you take it nice and slow and let's try to make sure we count one and two and three and four and counting makes it a lot easier to remember uh, where you are and uh, where to put your bass drum and your snare drum. So we're gonna play real slow. One and two and three and four and Now if we take that basic beat and we start slow and gradually work it up faster, you can practice this and uh, get it up to a nice comfortable speed. Make sure you listen to what you're playing, make sure it's uh, even, sounds good. Uh, it's better to play it right than to play it fast. Uh, speed will come in time. But let's give it a try. We'll start out real slow and then uh, we'll gradually speed up as we go. One and two and three and four and...
So there you go, there's your basic rock beat. Again, it's made up of three parts. Your right hand playing eighth notes, one and two and three and four and on the hi-hat. Your right foot playing one and three on the kick. And your left hand playing two and four on the snare. Uh, now, a couple other things. Obviously, uh, you can move this to any cymbal, uh, any other place you want. Uh, for example, here's a uh, one quick example on the ride with your right hand. So practice that too and it's also important to note that this is the basis for all other rock drum beats that you're gonna play in the future. Um, it's important to get really comfortable with this and especially your right hand playing those eighth notes. You should practice this so it becomes completely mindless. You can keep a tempo and make it nice and even and sound good and maybe even have a conversation while you do this. So you play one and two and three and four and and you can talk to other people, have a conversation, recite the Gettysburg Address, four score and seven years ago our forefathers brought forth upon this continent. I don't really know where it goes from there but you get the idea. So practice this Make sure you get it nice and even, nice and steady, work the speed up, work the speed down, and uh, good luck.